This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. Well, I feel like I just watched uh, Young Thug in court today. I think he's going to beat his case. Because it looks like the DA was not prepared for this case at all, man. Like, the judge was like, why didn't you give him back his evidence yet? Like, now the evidence you took and you extracted from his phones is tainted because you never gave his evidence back. And his lawyer, uh, Mr. Steele, is extremely savvy, okay? Like, he's he knows what he's doing. He's a shark. Um, he's doing everything a lawyer is supposed to do above and beyond, right? Like challenging the court, challenging the DA, challenging the evidence. I think that, you know, and I know Young Thug, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I know Gunna took a plea. And I'm sure Young Thug will be guilty of something, but it won't, won't be what they want. They're not going to get him for like a Rico charge where he's doing 10 years. They're not going to get him for the murder or nut, you know? it's suspicion at that point because you know black youngsters free and he rented the van that shot up young Dolph's car like let's these if you have a good enough lawyer you can take those things apart um i don't think they're gonna be able to use those lyrics against him um i just think that his lawyer is just too good gonna took a plea but they're not able to use that against young thug supposedly because it's an alfred plea and i don't know exactly what that if there's so many different kinds of pleas but his lawyer's adamant that this can't be his him admitting that ysl was a gang and that his rapping furthered the gang and that could just be promoting it ysl you know, he thought it, was, it started off as a music label and turned into a gang. He said, I denounced the gang, but he said YSL music is fine if you listen to his testimony. He also said that the any any uh, paraphernalia found in the car when him, him and Thug were pulled over wasn't his. But was it just him and Thug in the car or was it somebody else? You know, like it's still open-ended and we've seen things like that thrown out before, you know? Was the stop done to code? You know, like there's so many ways a lawyer can piece, pick that apart. Young Thug doesn't seem worried at all when he goes to court. The judge is starting to see that the DA wasn't completely prepared when they brought these charges. And <laughs> this is just, it's just looking like, um, I, 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 I am almost 100% sure Young Thug communicated through their lawyers to tell Gunner to take the plea deal and get out because he's just an artist. He has nothing to do with this. This is a, a Rico charge with Young Thug's guys that they're trying to pin against him through the whole YFN Lucci nut issue, you know, not passed away in 2015, caught, escalated an issue between him and YFN Lucci. And they've been publicly... Now, Young Thug's going to go to jail for a little bit of time because there were these public statements on Instagram where he was talking about crimes that happened, you know? And that wasn't rap lyrics. That was Instagram, you know? Pictures of taking, taking pictures of people's cars, uh, you know, just certain stuff that just... I don't know. I think things are going to go in his favor. We will see they're preparing for a trial in January. Uh, I wonder if he's going to go to trial or if they're going to like just offer him some type of like, hey, just do another year and then go home. You know, like do two years or three years because you already done a year, right? So like maybe you do two or three years. If you did three years, he'd be home pretty quick. I'll be honest with you. Gunna, they gave him a year served and then four years probation or something like that. And that's that. That could all go away after he does his uh, community service and, and meets requirements. So we'll see how this all shakes out, man. But it's looking kind of sloppy on the DA side, I gotta say. You can tell with the way the judge is talking. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.